Galen Armstrong sentenced to prison today for murdering cyclist Mariah Wilson in East Austin last year. Jury decided Armstrong should spend 90 years in prison. KVU's Malia Masamoto was in the courtroom when the sentencing was handed down today. She joins us now from the Travis County Courthouse. Malia, what can you tell us about the moment that sentence was read today? Well, Brian and Ashley, you know it's always going to be a lot of emotion and tension in that room when a sentence is read, let alone a 90-year sentence. Now, from Wilson's family, they looked relieved to see that as this has been a long process for them to get some justice. They all had their arms wrapped around each other when they heard that. Now, interestingly enough, Armstrong looked pretty similar as she's looked throughout this whole trial. Very stoic and not showing much visible emotion. Pretty shocking for just getting a 90 year sentence. Now today the jury spent about three and a half hours in deliberation. Yesterday it took them just about two hours. Now this is the third week in court and it's been extremely emotional for family and friends of Wilson as they've had to relive these terrible moments back again, hearing witness testimony and watching videos. Now after the sentence was read today, Mariah Wilson's friend Caitlin Cash gave an emotional statement where she talked about the night Wilson was killed. She was the one to find Wilson that night. Mariah's mom also took the stand and what she had to say to Caitlin Armstrong was heart wrenching. When you shot Mariah in the heart, you shot me in my heart. You shot Eric and Matt in their hearts. You shot Mariah's cousins and aunts and uncles and all the people who loved her. Again, really hard to hear that today. Now, outside the courthouse, Mariah's father said they were grateful to everyone who has helped them this past year and during this trial, but it's still a solemn day for everyone here. Other than the prosecution team, there really are no winners here. This is not a time for celebration, but a time for prayer. A time to pray for our family, our friends, and the family, the Armstrong family, and their friends. Now, Mariah's mother also said she was praying for Caitlin's healing during her statement in the courtroom today. Now, Caitlin Armstrong was facing anywhere from five to 99 years. The prosecution suggested the jury start at 40 years, but they ultimately decided on that 90 year sentence. Now, as a, uh, as a condition, she'll be eligible for parole after she serves half of her sentence or 30 years, whichever comes first. So in her case, that's gonna be 30 years. 